The man involved in a murder case from more than 15 years ago will stay behind bars. Shane Johnson asked the Nevada Board of Pardons today for a commuted or reduced sentence, but was denied. 8 News Now reporter Orko Manis spoke exclusively with the victim's family today and has their reaction. Jane Johnson pleaded guilty in 2004 for his role in the murder of 18-year-old Jared Whaley. It's a case that shocked many here in Southern Nevada. Investigators say Shane Johnson was part of a group of young men who killed Whaley in the fall of 2003, beating him until he was unrecognizable. According to police reports, Johnson used a stun gun to first shock Whaley, and then another teen shot him, all of this over drugs. Whaley was left in a shallow grave just outside Boulder City. His family spoke Wednesday in front of the Nevada State Board of Pardons Commissioners asking that Johnson be kept behind bars. After pleading guilty as a teen, Johnson was sentenced to life in prison with the eligibility of parole after 20 years. He is requesting a reduced sentence of 10 years to life in prison. However, the board did not commute Johnson's sentence, a victory for Whaley's family, but the pain is still there. The loss of a child is the worst thing you can go through. It's just an empty spot in your heart. It hurts. It hurts. It still affects me to this day. I, you know, it's, I, and now I have children and they see that kid in the family photos and he's not there. Family members tell me Whaley had plans to either join the military or become a mechanic. Johnson will be officially eligible for parole in 2024. Whaley's family says they will be at every hearing to make sure Johnson stays behind bars. In the studio, Orko Mana, 8 News Now.